Hello everyone, in this particular video, I will be talking about how to pre-fill dates in a Google form. Now, some of you might be having difficulties in filling in dates as is, as in when you have to pick a date from a row and fill it as a pre-filled link in a Google form. The easiest option is basically to use a question which is basically of a short answer type and then just fill in the numbers and then when you have the numbers in the response sheet you can basically then convert the numbers as a date now if you really need to fill in the dates as a date itself in that case what you need to do is you need to basically wrap the values in a text function and just note that Google form when you're pre-filling it will only accept the dates in this year, month and day format. So you need to basically use this text function to actually be able to do this. Let's look at this practically. I'm going to go to these three dots. I'm going to click on this get pre-filled link. Here you need to fill in some details. Let's say I'm going to do AA, DB and let me just take some random dates for now. I'm going to click on get link. I'm going to copy this link here. I'll come back to this particular form. And here I'm just going to show you the link as is. So this is basically the entire link that I just copied. From here to here is basically the form ID. And each of these questions have a unique question ID, which is basically these numbers. Okay. So this one was for item code. This one was for date as number and this one was basically for date as date. Now what we are going to do is we are going to use this code, replace it within this sample formula that you know I have already created. Now wherever you see this cell references, you basically need to put at quote ampersand sign activate the ranges basically and then put another ampersand sign and put a double quote this will pick the values from those columns so I see I've already made a mistake here uh, instead of AA I should have basically picked BB because item code is what I want here so I'm going to make this B colon B and now the second one is going to be C colon C and the last one is basically going to be D colon D so let's go ahead and just do that quickly okay I have just done it here and here so now whatever date is there in column D will be picked up as year month and date and whatever date is there in column C will basically be picked up as a number let's go ahead and submit a form to get this activated 